actually two beauty pageants running at the same time and uh, we've just come from the other one which is like the the, the one for the upper class and uh, now we're at the other one which is celebrating Independence Day right yeah right these girls participate to get in in the name of, of the city all of the girls are representing each one of the girls is representing one of the neighborhoods that that are in Cartagena so it's more local the the pageant the other one is more it's national and it's, it's more exclusive it's more exclusive so this one doesn't have the same sponsors it's more like the lower classes you can here see the locations are completely different the investments in this one are really lower than the other pageant and obviously this is just Katja Hiena Artena. whereas the other one is obviously the Miss Columbia yeah, Miss pageant Columbia. we're about to go up on out to the field I'm really excited because I've never been on a pitch before let's go up let's go. I've got my um, I'm supporting this girl here apparently Wow. I love the noise. They're all cheering for their uh, the team. I wonder if I hold this up if it will do anything. It's incredible. Yeah, you can definitely uh, see the difference between this uh, pageant and the other pageant. The other pageant had like air conditioning and Rolex watches. And uh, this passion has grass and lots of noise. I like it. I yeah, they're here. Yeah. And uh, what do these ones win? Do you know? No, I really don't know. I I, I know they are um, world most popular queen here in Cartagena, but but I really don't know where the prices are. I yeah. think it's completely different than the other ones. The other one goes to me universe. I don't think this one has the big opportunities yet that the other ones but have. they're both profiting from the fact that it's Independence Day they're both yeah. using the opportunity they're both celebrating oh, I like it I like they are both completely different different yeah. it was like yesterday when we went to the uh, festival in the streets and then we went to this like exclusive it party, party. It, okay. it was sh it, it's shocking the difference yes yeah. completely different <laughs> I'm getting an autograph from Miss Spain, Carta Fiena. So excited. And she's even got real boobs just like me. I prefer this competition. It makes me feel less like I have to succumb to the pressures of modern day society. Can you sign my bra? Would <laughs> you sign it? You good for good luck. Yeah. On the back, right here. Yeah. She's gonna sign my bra for good luck. Hopefully, I'll get some of her queen magic, and I'll be able to find the one. I don't know if it's going to work, probably won't really, but I'm open, we'll try. <laughs> Things you've got to do for video on the internet. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> She says she didn't even know how she got the the, the the name because she was at her place once and the mayor called her and told her come to the, to the office that you're the new Miss Cartagena. And now, what's the biggest difference between this competition? 
Colombian Miss Colombia. What is the grand difference? She thinks the only difference is that the women of the pageant are from the around the country, and this one is from Cartagena only because she thinks this pageant has a lot more beautiful women than the ones in the pageant of the national really? pageant. Why do you think the ones in this competition are more beautiful? Porque dice que son totalmente naturales. In this pageant, most of the concurrent and the contestants are completely natural. They don't have any surgeries. And in the pageant and the National Beauty Pageant, there are some girls with with surgeries and all that stuff. So that's why she think these ones are more beautiful because they are completely natural. And uh, is it because they can't afford it, the girls in this pageant? Okay, no se Okay, she thinks two things. One is that they can afford the surgeries because they are too expensive. And second is because these women were born with all the beauty they needed in the in life. They don't need to get any surgeries and they don't think they need any surgery to participate in a contest. So that's why they don't get it any. And um, I noticed some other differences like there's more darker skinned women here in this uh, competition and more lighter skin in the other competition. She thinks this pageant is perfect because most of the girls are black and when they get to the pad, what, what they're trying to do is to get in the pageant more black girls in the in the con in the contestant because because right now the only departments with with the participants black it's San Andres and Chocó there aren't any more so this is what this pageant is trying to do to get this contestant to the national this is trying to get more people yeah. from maybe a disadvantaged background into the main pageant yes. yeah oh, that's very good well it's been nice talking to you para llegar a hacer lo que es. She's thanking you for coming here to Cartagena and visiting and supporting this beauty pageant because that's what Colombia and Cartagena need. Okay, good. Thank you very much. Yes. Yes. Thank you very much. Yes. So, um, what I basically learned is that this uh, pageant is uh, getting girls from much poorer backgrounds and it's, they're trying to get more black women into the main Miss Columbia pageant. So at the moment it's a very white only contest, which I think is a brilliant idea. Um, and make it less sort of exclusive and less elite. The beauty contest, the beauty pageant here in Cartagena is about to start. I can't even tell you how amazing the atmosphere is. This is incredible. We're down here on the baseball pitch. We've got the stage behind us. The crowd are going absolutely insane. I mean, I can never ever imagine this reaction from an American or British beauty contest. It's incredible. Where are the queens? be good. I wonder if I can join on the end. See ya, bye! Not my plan! <laughs> Joke. That's, that's as far as I'm allowed to go. I ain't got the legs for that. Yeah, cheers, Mum. I gotta say, this pageant has a lot more spirit than the other one. This is more exciting for me. I mean, I like champagne flutes and uh, air conditioning. Actually, I don't. But this is an experience. So, uh, Colombia is well known for beautiful girls, and uh, I think this is the test. Sorry. This is what a whole horde of Colombian women look like. Yes, boys, great holiday destination. <laughs> Thank you.